In other words, you're, you're complementing and supporting the continuity of power supply then uh, for uh, Taiwan. Horace, is this a pro bono public service or is this monetized or commercialized in some way? No, it is actually monetized. We're, you know, we right. believe, you know, the thesis has always been to do good, do good and do well, right? You know, sustainability is about not just, you know, creating solutions that you can actually, you know, turn green, but at the same time, leveraging the solutions that you already have so that you can actually create more opportunity for the business to, to, to be prosperous. Uh, it really is part of a three-step process for us. Uh, the first step you, you probably saw last year, uh, GoGirl really participate with the electric grid to stop charge or stop taking energy when you know the, the grid actually cannot supply it. So we can dynamically stop charge, and that was the first step in the, in the pilot. The second step in the pilot was safely and reliably being able to push energy back to the grid. So on an hourly basis, the Taiwan Energy, Taiwan Power actually has a bidding process uh, for you know basically who can actually supply this energy back to the grid, shall the grid actually demand it. And so it's a, it creates a secondary, you know, second revenue stream without creating any uh, additional cost to the, to the company. These are batteries and stations that are already deployed. And we use the excess energy that we have already to actually push that back to the grid and sell it back, so to speak. Right. So there's a there's a bidding process uh, and an offer charge process for us. And then really the third step for us to really realize the entire vision, uh, which is coming around the corner for us, is really full energy storage solutions that uses our batteries when it comes off the vehicle riding grid and onto, you know, I don't believe, you know, we, we don't really quickly believe in recycling yet. We think there's just so much more juice and so much more energy in batteries, uh, even beyond mobility, that we can actually cluster these up and create a legitimate big scale energy storage solution uh, for every country we go to. So, for example, in Taiwan today, uh, we have slightly over two gigawatt hour battery uh, on the network. And then with this particular, you know, with this particular service, we're turning on about 150 megawatt hour any time of the day so that we can actually push this push of energy back to the grid. But ultimately for us, it's really to create a, you know, a, 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 you know I think of it as a, a, a gigantic reservoir uh, for sustainable energy.